Hi, this is Brian Smith from Big Brain Audio. In the first video on Holder, I gave you an overview and showed you how to create some glitchy, loopy sounds. In this video, I'd like to show you how you can quickly create richly morphing ambient and drone sounds with Holder. In this Ableton Live set, I've got three instances of Holder, one in each audio track. In this first track, we have a simple trumpet phrase. Let's listen to the dry sound without Holder. We'll set Holder to its default setting by just clicking here, turn it on, and make sure the dry is all the way down to, to uh, all the way off to minus infinity, and we'll play the trumpet through. Now we'll set up the buffer time to a higher value. Shoot up the blur so that there's a lot of interpolation between the different buffer slices here. And then set the mode to the still mode so we're just hearing one of the slices right now coming through. So we're already getting kind of a droney sound. In the second track, I've got a simple strummed acoustic guitar sound transpose two octaves down. Here's the dry sound. The richness of string instruments provides an excellent source of spectral content for Holder to work with. Let's listen to the sound with Holder on. Notice I've got the blur also at a high setting here. Long buffer sizes dry all the way down. And we have a nice evolving sort of drone texture from that guitar sound. The third track has a voice sample. Here's the dry original. I want you to listen very, very carefully. I want you to listen And now with Holder. The buffer takes a minute to pull in the sound. You'll notice I've got some automation going on here in the Droneizer, moving it back and forth. It's moving at a different rate than the actual loop length because I've got an unlinked envelope going on here. And now if I get the other two channels on at the same time, We have a really nice combination of different sounds going on here. Using these very simple techniques, Holder can help you create some very rich drone ambiences. By experimenting with different audio material and parameter settings, you'll be amazed at the large variety of sound textures you can generate with Holder. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.